Hi guys and welcome into another Let's Play and today I'm playing Time Splitters Future Perfect on the PlayStation 2. Now this is the first time I've played Future Perfect in the series of the Time Splitters franchise uh, and this one I've never played it so we're going to see if it lives up to its hype as its predecessor which I hopefully think it will. Now on this we're just going to do some campaign mode. Because I could do some multiplayer, but because I've not played this game, I've not unlocked all the maps, weapons, and characters, and etc. So we're just gonna have a bit of fun looking at the campaign mode, see if it's improved from the previous Time Splitters, or if it's just the played safe. We'll just uh, check it out. Okay, evidently we've crashed. That's why we're dangling upside down. Hey, there's Sergeant Cortez, and he's alive. Hi guys. Oh, at first. Oh, that's gotta hurt. You okay, Sarge? Tell him me. On, Sarge. We've got to get you back to base. Whatever you did really stirred up the splitters. We need all the firepower we can muster. Take this weapon, Sarge. Come on, this way. Come in, come okay, in. we're gonna do this. But right after I change my invert loop, I don't like it like this. I'll rub it off. Just make it easy for me. Okay, let's move. Jeez, look at the size of that thing. That is a beast. Look sharp, Marines. Oh Keep god. Coming. Oh shoot again, pressing melee then. Who are they? They're not splitters. Worry about it later. Just take them down. We've got to get Cortez back to base. More of them! Yep, I can see him. Hey, Cortez, oh, why do I keep pressing the melee? Gun takes an eternity to reload. What's their problem? I'm moving so far that uh, when you play the game, you've got like the nice fact that the ship's crashed and you go straight into the missions. And you also got, you know, all your, your buddies helping you. You've got like your little um, look like privates helping you, you know, your soldiers. Helping, which is nice because I can. The second one, you have really no assist on this, so you have no real help. So I like that little touch. As well, the guns are just as usual, just amazingly out there, wild, which I love. Oh, sweet gun. This is what we're talking about. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Dogfight. Oh, you dozy sods broke the bridge. Don't believe it, they've blown up the bridge again! We've had to rebuild that seven times already! God, I'll curl us off it. Seven times? Oh, a big ship's... Oh, it's crashed, it's blown up. Oh, Jesus. Crash landing. <laughs> Oh, that was pretty epic. Oh my god, it's near scared me that. What the hell is that? Ugly anyway. Oh! Oh, okay. What the frig's that? It's, in it's invisible. Oh, is it one of them things? Oh. I've got a twin mounted machine gun and it's friggin' awesome. And I'm killing these alien things cause they're friggin' bombs. General. Cortez, you made it. Have you got them? Right here. Good. Let's get them to the lab. Our team has found that when the crystals are used for time travel, they leave an energy residue. We've recalibrated our scanners and we can now trace specific locations where they've been used. And what are you hoping to find there? Anything that will lead us to the source. I know it's not much to go on, but it's all we've got. General. Cortez, meet Anya, our chief science officer. Is that them? Beautiful. Bring them over to the machine and let's get them plugged in. Now I've located energy residue in numerous places, but the highest concentration is right here. That's in the ocean. It is now, but there used to be an island there, and 
was destroyed during a battle in 1924. But when were the crystals used? That we don't know. Calculating the location of the energy pockets is one thing, but we have no way of knowing when the time jumps actually occurred. But you're thinking those time jumps probably happened right before that island was destroyed. Exactly. Here, put out your arm. What's that? It's an uplink to the time machine. I've set it to take you to the island just before its destruction. Sorry, Cortez, but I need to send my best man on this. And that's you. I should have guessed. All right. Find the crystals and destroy the lot. <laughs> How hard could it be? of a hand. I say, what are you doing way out here, old chap? I'm supposed to be on that island. Are you sure, Bean? This whole area is about to be bombed to kingdom come. By who? Well, by the Navy, of course. Damn it. Those Navy chaps won't attack until they get my signal. But, well, that was my best pipe, you bounders! No, don't! Get down! Good shot, old man. I don't think much of this weapon. Uh, uh, excuse me. Thank you. Rats! The gunboat's got me pinned down, old chap. Can you disable the turret somehow? Of course, old chap. Righty ho, we'll just lower this. Got it. I'll chuck it at the edge of the boat, try and chuck it in the water. Oh well, I suppose that could do, it stopped it. Oh, it's got little legs. <laughs> Thank you, Pay. Give me health pack. And oh, oh, can I drive it, please, please, please? I want to drive it? Yay! Oh, be sweet. Wilbur, if I could drive proper. Bridge up the son of a bitch. Hang on, let me just kill these sods first. And we'll open it soon. There's a little fella. That's how we do it. I'm so I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Right, there we go. Oh, for God's sake. Right, off we go. We're here. Hmm, big strong door. Looks like we'll have to blast our way inside. Yeah. Right, well, we'll have to find some explosives. Grenades don't give enough bad. Here we are. Run! It's me. It's all me. I am best. Bestest guard. Without me, no guarding. All rubbish guarding. God of guards. And girls. Girls love me. So hairy chest. Such a big medallion. You fucking idiot. He's here. <laughs> God, you stubborn gag, get out of the way. Grenade. Thank God for that. Anyone hiding? Don't 
far away. There you go. Oh my god, what are you doing? Well, oh hello. Ding dong. Oh my god. Okay, dokie, that's how to make an entrance and an epic fail at all at once. I'll go get help. Ah, it's you again. Oh, love that. Splendid. Well, I found my uh, assistant, but she's locked up in here. Yes. I can't find the damn key. Can you help me get her out, old chap? We can't blast the door. We might Ooh. kill him in the explosion. They like just big just things, though, don't you? <laughs> there must be another what, what? Ding dong. What? A tank? Oh, tank! Oh my, a tank. I think we're in trouble. Ready? Let's go for it. Go, 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 go! Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it! Come on! Mmm. Right, I'm gonna call this a night, but I have absolutely enjoyed playing this game. You know, I was worried for, is it gonna be any good to the predecessors of the other games, you know, the first two? Because it was EA as well to cover, uh, doing it instead of the, I forgot the other teams, ADOS and ADOS or something like that. I thought it might spoil, like, completely change the gameplay and, like, stuff messing around, but, you know, it's just, it's just got better and better. I've absolutely enjoyed playing it the campaign mode but sadly I didn't have a memory card at the time plugged in so I've not saved it but luckily I think this is only the second mission I've done so it shouldn't take long to do again if you want me to do another if you want to carry on doing a series of this playing the multiplayer leave the text or as well if you want to do some bit of multiplayer uh, doing playing against the old um, AI bots let me know comment below so thanks for watching guys thoroughly enjoyed this game if you never played time split series why not? If you love your shooter games, get it. And if you have PS2, yeah, get it. Or Xbox and GameCube if you're on as well. So, thanks for watching, guys, and bye bye.